Hey, uh, do you have any uh, preliminary sort of evaluation of how the red gold thing is, is going this year? How do you feel about how, how it went? Uh, we haven't gotten a lot of direct feedback other than uh, people love both red and gold leader. Uh, I've had several conversations with them and with people uh, about them. It's amazing. And it's, it was genuinely random. Uh, I will tell you exactly how I chose it was we have a, a, a full manifest, you know, 1,000, however many plus lines, line, yeah. and then I just plugged in a random number generator, pick me this person, check if they were on the list to opt out, there's our winner. Same thing for, for Gold Team. Uh, I, I, we wanted very much to, you know, the one thing I was worried about was to keep it from getting too competitive. I mean, it's fun to be a little silly with each other in a little light competition, but we did not want it to feel like a rivalry in any way. And I ho I've certainly gotten no feedback that's been problematic for anyone, at least directly. Uh, oh, and the two shows aspect. What's that? The two shows oh, the two show aspect. aspect. Yeah, I mean, uh, I haven't gotten too much uh, feedback about how it's been working out. I can tell you from from my perspective, here's the thing that I didn't think about until uh, a few weeks before the cruise, is that, oh, I'm never going to get to eat dinner in the dining room. Uh, and it's, you know, two, two shows a night is, is hard for a, a performer to do, I mean, depending on what the, what the act is. But, um, so in that way, it's been a little bit challenging. But uh, I don't know, it seems... Um, I haven't heard anything uh, either way about it, uh, which makes me think that it can't, it can't have been too terrible. I mean, how are you, how are you guys feeling about it? Is it, is it seem to be working out okay? We worry about you guys. You worry about oh, us? Please. We're fine. Yeah, please. Yeah. We, we thank you for your concern, but we're grown-ups. We, we, we know what we got ourselves into. <laughs> right. Yeah, we, we signed a big fat contract to have this happen to us. And, <laughs> and really, there, there, there wasn't really a choice. Uh, the choice was to stay as a group, and we just felt like the event would just ossify, cease to grow, and wouldn't be fun for us, wouldn't be fun for anybody. So, And we really wanted to get to this point of having the whole ship because of the things that it allows us to, to do and just gives us so much more flexibility as far as programming and customization and, and all that stuff. Um, so it, you know, it felt like an important and, place to get to. And while there's of course been variation between the shows just because any live show is going to have some variation, they have not been so wildly different that at least as, a per as personally seeing both shows, it does, to me it doesn't seem like anybody's genuinely missing yeah, out. It's, it's not like so there's a good one and a bad one. Yeah. You know? <laughs> and then the, the other big thing that we, we threw at the wall was saying, okay, but we still want to have a moment where we can all be together in one place and enjoy things and talk about them in real time and afterwards. And of course, that was yesterday in Loretto. So I think it's safe to say that that was, it worked. <laughs> and, that, and that was something that was based off directly off of the feedback that we got from everyone when we put out a poll about the possibility of moving to a whole ship. We knew how important it was to everyone to maintain a sense of community because that whole, you know, until this point, everybody was always essentially at everything together. And we knew that was important and we wanted to still maintain at least some of that. Uh, hopefully it worked. So and we hope you enjoyed that. Yeah. And we're all still we're all still on one ship together. And that's the beauty of it. We're all still mingling and going to shadow cruise events and karaoke and whatever. And it, and it still feels like one big happy group, which is nice. How um, about giving, giving you guys a uh, like an hour between the, the dinner times and the shows? Well, well, then then it turns into a whole scheduling thing. We we're we're covered. We got food <laughs> back here. We're all okay. <laughs> well, yeah, good. We're all worried. You're all starving back. Not in a scene. No, no, we thought that. We thought it is physically it, food. It is literally physically impossible to starve on a cruise ship. <laughs> I believe most of the things backstage are edible. Okay. <laughs>